Hi everyone, welcome back to my lab and today's video which is going to be an unboxing of a brand new subscription box that I just joined. Before I get into my video, if you're new to my channel, I'm Jodi. I love subscription boxes. I think that they're a really fun way to try out makeup products that you may not otherwise purchase for yourself. And when I heard about this one, I had always been very curious. But this one was in collaboration with another YouTuber whose name is Porcelain. Her real name is Bridget. And I really enjoy her content. So when I saw that she was collaborating with them, I definitely definitely thought it was a great time to support. So let's go ahead and get into my box. So as I mentioned, Porcelain is another YouTuber. I really enjoy her channel. She does a lot of reviews and tutorials and her, she's very honest in her reviews. I really enjoy her videos. She's very relatable and it's so exciting that Tribe Beauty Box wanted to collaborate with her. Now one nice thing about Tribe Beauty Box is that they focus only on cruelty-free brands. If you prefer to keep your beauty cruelty-free, then something like BoxyCharm may not necessarily be the best option for you since not all products are cruelty-free free but in this box they are and another unique thing about this box is that they include a variety of products where they give you something for eyes a skincare item a tool and a lip product kind of like a full face kind of thing which is also really nice it is also an every other month subscription service the value of it is $34.95 but there is shipping so it comes to about 40 US dollars I think that this is a Canadian based company but looking at my shipping label this shipped from North Carolina so I guess they have a warehouse in the US so this is my first box and this is what it looks like it says try beauty box X porcelain and that's so cute that's her channel name so I will leave her linked in the description box down below if you want to check her out I do enjoy her videos and she posts every single day which I don't even know how people can do that but I think that YouTube is now her full-time job so when you open up the box, this is what it looks like. There's an, an informational card and there's Bridget. Her lovely picture is on the card. You have a list of all the products that are in the box as well as the retail values. So I'll go through the retail values as I unbox each item. So the first thing that is in my box, there's two of them actually, and these are from Masquerade and they're sheet masks. They are hydrating sheet masks and I have the Beauty Restore as well as the Detox Diva. These are really nice. I always enjoy a good sheet mask for a relaxation. And looking at the card, the sheet masks retail for $6 a piece and so these are valued at $12. US Very nice items. Next, I have something from Wonder Beauty and this is the Glow Ahead Face Oil. This is nice. All right, here's what it looks like. It's um, interesting. Oh, okay. So it's kind of a squeezy tube and it has a dropper bottle with a screw on cap, which is good because face oil, that's something that can get really messy if it starts leaking. This is from Wander Beauty and it's a signature blend of eight powerful yet lightweight beauty oils that instantly restore skin's youth, balance, and glow. And the retail value for this one is $48. Very curious to try this out. I love a good face oil. So, so far these seem to be very like skincare type items. That's awesome. The next item in the box is what made me buy the box. They have spoilers on what items are going to be in the box and Bridget did present this in her YouTube reveal of the collaboration. And this is something I've been wanting to buy. It is from Suva Beauty and it is the Block Party eyeshadow palette. This is something I've been wanting to buy because the Beauty News girls have been raving about it. And that's specifically true of Kat. She has been raving about the quality of this eyeshadow palette and it's kind of a rainbow palette. So here's what it looks like. The palette does reflect the outer packaging. I'm sorry it's a little holographic there. Alright, we do have a mirror and a plastic sleeve and there are your colors. Wow. I knew I was going to buy these eventually and it's just wonderful that I got to get it that I received it in a subscription box and now I get to try it out. Those are beautiful colors. Another nice thing about this box is that they do send you spoilers and if for some reason you don't want to receive that specific box, I think you can cancel them. So that's something really nice. This eyeshadow palette from Suva Beauty retails for $30 and I believe this is a variation item. You could have also received the saffron palette for $35 but this is the one I'm, I wanted so I'm so glad I got that one. Next, I do have a lip product, and this one is from IBY Beauty. I think I received this brand in my BoxyCharm. And this one is a liquid to matte lipstick. 
It retails for $12. It says it's highly pigmented and indulgent. This creamy liquid to matte lipstick creates a larger than life smile that is vivid and lustrous. Look at that. It's a very pretty shade. It would go with the eye look I'm wearing today. This is the shade Berry Berry. That's the shade that I got. Very nice doe foot applicator. Okay, if I didn't say the retail price of that one is $12. And last but certainly not least, we have a collection of brushes from Luxie Beauty. And this one is the Luxie Flawless Eye Set. They're super tiny brushes. Now Bridget does mention that she has hooded eyes like I do. And so she prefers small brushes. This one is retailed at at $30 and it says you can take your party looks to the next level with this professional grade eye brush set. Tackle the most precise eye looks with this set. Very nice. It includes the Luxie 111, 121, 131, and 141. So for beautiful brushes, I do enjoy Luxie Beauty brushes and they are cruelty free. So that's everything that was inside my box. Not bad at all for $35. 40-ish dollars including shipping. I like the items. So far I'm really happy. I'm excited to see what I get in my next box. If you want to see a review on any of the items that I received in my box, just let me know down below. And if you're subscribed to Tribe Beauty Box, let me know how you feel about it and how you've been getting on with it. I'm now subscribed to BoxyCharm, FabFitFun, and Tribe Beauty Box. I was subscribed to the Ricky's NYC subscription box. I think they called it, um, I forget what they called it, but I think that they canceled it because suddenly I stopped receiving boxes. So I guess I'm not subscribed to that anymore. But like I said, I do enjoy receiving new brands, new products to try that I may not ordinarily have sought out on my own. And so I just think it's fun. That's everything for my unboxing. Just a simple unboxing. Usually I like to do try-ons with my boxy charms and things like that, but I just wanted to share my first experience with the box and so far so good. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. If you find it entertaining or helpful in any way, please don't forget to give it a big like for me. I really appreciate it. If you have any questions for me, leave those in the comment section down below. Otherwise, I look forward to seeing you again on my next video, which should be very, very soon. Thank you so much for joining me today. Bye-bye. <laughs>